Browsing and learning to use the internet is yes! One of the easiest and funnest things to do today. A click here, another click there, and we can be anywhere. You can meet people from around the world. Hi! Read amazing stories and histories of the past. Ooh. And even have a glance of what may be seen in the future. But remember, using the internet without proper guidance and enough knowledge can also be one of the scariest we can ever imagine. Ooh. Imagine going on an online trip, seeing the beauty of the place, when suddenly, potential scams pop up and block your way. Hmm, scams? These are dishonest tricks used to deceive people, and we don't want that to happen to any of us. So, be your own hero online. Be internet alert. If it's too good to be true, then it's most likely fake. Fair exchanges shouldn't ask for your personal information. Always think twice or ask for the assistance of your parents and guardians before accessing a new site. Be on guard for possible phishing that will ask you to log in and give your important personal details. Whew, that was close! Good thing, I am internet alert. Remember, any effort to steal your information may be a form of scam. So always trust your intuition and distinguish what's real and what's fake online. This has been your online hero, Mom Jennifer, reminding you to Beware by being aware, keep your learning safe, and don't fall for fake. Babuhay! Good day to all! I am your tutor, Madge. Welcome to Itulan, a free online tutorial, an initiative of the Department of Education, Information and Communications Technology Service, Educational Technology Unit, ICTS, EdTech. This program is aimed at helping and assisting learners from kindergarten, senior high school, all alive and sped learners. Aside from answering the modules, the Itulai is offering programs which you will surely look forward to. Together with our parents and teachers, the Itulai will bridge the gap where difficulty and ease meet in learning new knowledge and skills. So, let us prepare our modules pen and paper. Ready your mind to see and hear worthwhile and interesting lessons. Let us now study and learn together with our volunteer online tutors. Tara na! Hello everyone! Happy July Monday afternoon again, senior high school students who are availing the free online tutorial hatid ng DepEd EdTech Unit. We are now on our uh, last session for quarter 2 sa General Chemistry 1. Again, I am Tutor Ann from SDO Las Piñas. Good afternoon everyone. I am Tutor Abe from SDO Paranaque and again, Welcome to the second quarter, week eight, for our summative and recognition para sa mga students, teachers, and schools na walang sawang sumusuporta sa DepEd Itulay. So this, this is our last session for the semester for General Chemistry 1. So next semester, you will be taking up again, uh, you will be taking up General Chemistry 2. Pero don't worry, you may avail the online tutorial for General Chemistry 2 sa YouTube ng DepEd EdTech Unit. It's already available for you to learn in advance. Kindly share the link with the hashtag Itulay Level Up, hashtag Itulay Ang Bayanihan para mas marami pa tayong makasama para sa ating online session for today. So learning and championing together, diba, despite of the pandemic. So we are here, uh, we are together as we uh, try to learn. So and 
we teachers, we are trying to de deliver this sa ganitong mga platforms and we are happy na tayo ang nabigyan ng ganitong opportunity. So medyo naging emo tayo ngayon kasi last day ng quarter two. So ayan. So but before that, how do you reward yourself? Lagi tayo may pa-question, di ba? How do you reward yourself when you achieve something? Ikaw, Tutor Abi. Uh, yung mga students, we want you to answer this question then. Since uh, medyo achieve na natin ng quarter two, mm -hmm. mag-iintay na lang tayo na ma yung makomplete yung ating mga grades. So, you think of a way on how you reward yourself. So, I want our students to also uh, answer in the chat box. So, ikaw, Tutor Abe, how do you reward yourself? Okay. So, lagi ko sinasabi, no, in rewarding ourselves kasi na hindi naman siya yung kailangan, malaking-malaki yung achievement mo bago magbigyan ng reward yung sarili mo, no? So, kahit konti lang yung achieve mo, pero alam mo sa sarili mo na it can uh, uh, contribute something sa buhay mo. So, sa akin, no, I am a uh, Siguro pwedeng buy yourself something nice, eat your favorite food or yung mga cravings natin. So dapat pagbigyan natin yung sarili natin. And pwede din we can spend a day with a friend or yung family member mo who makes you smile. And yung uh, alam mo na kapag sinayaran mo ng mga achievements mo yung uh, who will be proud of you. So medyo nakakatouch kasi no, kapag meron kang sinayaran ng mga achievements mo sa buhay. So ikaw, Tutor Anne. Okay, so ako, uh, how do I reward myself? I try to buy nga. Sim simple things o kaya mm -hmm. yung mga things na kailangan ko as I work from home. So, minsan yung mga, yung mga medyo mag -e elevate sa laptop, kung yun yung makakapagpadali sa yun na on, on using in the laptop, o kaya yung ma magandang upuan para maging comfortable ka as you work. So, yung mga ganun bagay, reward yourself. Ibigay mo yan sa sarili mo kasi kung walang, ano ba, kung, kung ano ba sa mga students natin o kaya sa mga teachers ang una niyo isipin kung huwag niyo isipin na ah, hindi ako binigyan ng ganito isipin niyo kayo magbigay sa sarili niyo para at least uh, nararamdaman ng sarili niyo na uh, rewarded din so may mabuboost kayo on doing other things so may mag, mga nag uh, reply dito Tutor Abe okay. nakalagay sa comment section I buy ice cream po sabi ni Allen Mark De Jesus and uh, Also, nag-reward, sabi ni Miguel, I reward myself by watching K-drama, o oh, diba, usong-uso yan ngayon, or mm -hmm. series every Sat and Saturday, uh, Saturday and Sunday, after accomplishing all my school works, yes, masipag yan wow. si Miguel Calvo Tanyola, very diligent. So, also, nag I, I like lovely and selfish, ano, ano yan, medyo, medyo nagula na ako sa sagot, uh, in here, buy something for myself, sabi ni Fritz Casas, yes, para tayo Fritz, para na, na re-reward na natin natin sarili. Nabili po ng pagkain, sabi ni Ilona. Sabi ni Constantine, I reward myself by spending quality time with my family and friends. Yes, kasi siya may family. Constantine. So, uh, let's give that time to our families and friends. Uh, friends, kasi may social obligation din tayo. So, ayan, mm -hmm. kailangan ng ganun. Playing video games and having fun with them. Uh, sabi ni Angelica, uh, sabi ni Christian Huli, foods lang po. So, sapat na sa foods. Sapat na. Okay. Uh, by, sabi ni Angelica Gregorio, by buying materials for my hobbies, watch movies with friends, la, uh, and buying books, deserve ko po. Yes, deserve ni Angelica yan. Mm -hmm. So dito, uh, sa mga nagsagot dito, yes, uh, deserve niyo po. Agony, Maria, so ayan may mga are in the second batch. So dito po sa ating uh, session, sa Gen Chem 1, uh, yung Gen Chem 2 available yun sa next quarter. So... So mga students, thank you for replying. Nakita ko yung Tutor Abe, I would like to request uh, uh, na maidagdag si Allen sa ating gagawin later. Sorry Allen, basta uh, bas, okay. I will explain na lang later. Kasi mm -hmm. nga pala si Allen is very uh, con, uh, anto, consistent na umaaten din sa ating tutorial. So mm -hmm. mamaya... Saka pala ang version ng comment ngayon, no? Oo. Uh, Mag-message ka sa akin Allen, later, ha? So, mamaya, you'll know why. So, let us have first our summative assessment. So, choose the letter of the best answer. So, we will be reading ten que uh, some questions that is related to what we have discussed in the, in the second quarter. And we want you to answer in the comment section. Just type in the answer. Ayan, sumagata si Allen. Yes po. Communicate ka sa akin na via messenger. Okay, for question number one, how many electrons are shown in the Lewis electron that structure of carbon. So we have provided here the illustration. Can you type in the answer in the comment section? Oh, yeah, may nag answer for everyone. I said, by listening to music, I'm deeply inspired by our lessons. Okay, so ayan. 
Ayun. greetings from Hogwarts. Ayan, may nag-answer na siya tra si Edward Bagay, okay. si Joshua Jaikpin, si Mark Gian Abejero, Iverson Kilatan, Emmanuel Mejia, Madeo, Jose, Fritz Casas, Angelica Gregorio. Ang answer nila ay pare-parehas. Barbie, Justin, Noeli, Aaron, Frances, Ilona. The answer is letter C. Tingnan nga natin, Chutor Abey. <laughs> Napindot ko na, Chutor Ad. Kasi feeling ko, yung mga chutis natin, alam na alam yan. Siyempre, alam na alam nila yan. Question hmm. number two. Okay. In Lewis structures, the valence electrons are represented by A dots, B lines, C arrows, D dash. Madali lang to, chutis. Okay, so... Chutis pa kailagyan ng number, no? Para hindi maligaw yung answers. Okay, let us wait. So, sabi ni Edward, ni Alan Mark Desus, A, ni Emmanuel, ni Miguel, ni, ayan, the same answer sila, Chuter Abe, kasi I know, hindi mo nakikita sa screen, naka-full screen ka. Oo nga eh. Si Luna, si Aaron, si Madeo, si Justin, ang sagot nila ay, show the answer na po, Chuter Abe, sa ganun din si Mark Gian and si Justin. Okay, correct. The answer is letter A. Thank you, Denise, also for answering. Denise Lachica. Okay, number three, a covalent bond is A, bond that shares electrons metallically, B, a bond that shares electrons with non-metals, C, metalloids bonding, D, metals and non-metals bonding. So, ayan, very quick lang, ano ba ang covalent bond? Oh, oh. Metallically, or B, a bond that shares electrons with non-metals, uh, C, Metal, metalloids bonding, D, metals and non-metals bonding. Mm -hmm. For sure, alam nila yan. Okay, the answer, nakalagay sabi ni Constantine, B, Allen, B, the same, Emmanuel, Simon, uh, Hans, Frances, uh, Isaiah, Madeo, Iverson, Ilona. So, reveal na natin. The answer is, okay, correct. So, yan, gets na gets naman nila yan. So, sila sila yung very consistent na nagsasagot. Pero may mga nadagdag, ha? may mga nakita ko na nag-participating ngayon. Siguro, Sa, sa mga ibang students na nandito pero hindi lang pala sagot sa comment section baka ngayon ko lang nabasa yung name pero I know you are participating sa inyong uh, kanyang mga bahay. For number four, an ionic bond is a bond that shares electrons. So we have the same options, bond that shares electrons metallically, bond that shares electrons with non-metals, Metalloid bonding and metal and non-metal bonding. Ano ba ang ionic bond? Okay, the answer, kindly type in the comment section. Number four. Si Constantine ang unang nag-answer, uh, letter D. Okay, sabi ni Noeli, A. Sabi ni Justin, A. Ni Denise, na Chica A, Fritz Casas A, Iverson D. So, nahati dito oh, sa A or D. Kindly show the, uh, yeah, the answer, Chatter Abay. Okay, the answer, kapag ionic bonding, when you say ionic bonding, it is a combination of a metal and a non-metal. Okay, let us proceed with number five. Which of the following is an exception to the octet rule? So, itong mga examples na ito, it may look, uh, um, they are... Yung nagfa-follow ng octet rule, may, uh, I mean, which of the following is an exception? Lahat sila stable, pero yung isa dyan, pero exception, exception ng octet rule. Mm -hmm. Ibig sabihin, hindi uh, eight, no? Yung valence yes, electron ng central okay. atom. So, I think, alam nila yan. Uh, shout out ulit kay Constantine. <laughs> may baka ba mga isa shout out at while waiting, we're now on number five. There are some students di yata nagtatype in ng ng number letter lang yata. Oh, Sabi, okay. good afternoon po from 11 STEM BIO, PNHS. Hi! Andrea, Andrea Abraso, National High School. Manlolo. Hi, Andrea. So, magot na si Constantine. Ang answer niya ay C. Ganon din si Noeli Fajardo, C. Simon Patdu, C. Aaron Linogon, C. Bakit? Okay, can let us show the answer to <laughs> Rabe. Okay, so the answer is... Okay, so ang mga, ang common na answer nila dito sa number 5 tutor Abe is letter, letter C. C. 
kapag si uh, kapag letter C so N F 3 so uh, tatlo yung F 2 4 6 then may na, may ano pa yun eh lone pair na dalawa lone may pair. Pa, eight pa eight pa rin yon while yung letter D mm-hmm. sabi ni Francis Elijah ang sagot niya ay letter D so that is an exception to the octet rule kasi kung may five bonding pairs ka so it that will equal to 10 so hindi okay. siya nakapag-follow ng octet rule so that's number 5 mm-hmm. number 6 how many bonding pairs are there in a tetrahedral structure? So more on molecular geometry na po tayo. How many bonding pairs are there in a tetrahedral structure? Okay so, lang naman kung nag-ano sila. No? Medyo na-confuse sila sa number 5. Kasi 20 questions naman to. So okay lang yan. Bawi. How many bonding pairs six? are there in tetrahedral structure? Tetrahedral, mm-hmm. naalala pa kaya nila? 6 daw okay. ay B. Taka. Okay, medyo na lit na, na, na ano no. na kailangan nila mag-recall oh. ng structure molecular geometry. Kasi may How? tetra, may tetra. Yeah, si Joshua Jaikti ng sagot niya ay A4. Sabi ni Iverson B, tetrahedral. Wala pala dito yung molecular geometry kit ko no, sa ayo. Sabi Fritz ay Ah, A, sabi ni Madeo A. So, may nag-answer ng A, may nag-answer ng B. So, tingnan natin kung ang sagot. Ano ang sagot? Nag-answer na rin si Andrea and si Barbie and si Fritz. So, the answer is? Okay, the answer is letter A. Next, number seven. Ayan. How many lone pairs are there in CISO, molecular geometry? So sana natatandaan pa nila yung structure, no? So kahit yung sa isip lang nila. Or if you have time, pwede nyo pang i-drawing sa inyong mga papers para makita ninyo kung ano ba yung C. So. Okay, nag-answer na rin po Elsa Cordova Abashar. Ang answer po niya ay A sa C. So how many lone pairs are lone there in C? Pair. So o probably baka itong answer ng ay not for number 7. Uh, let us Uh-oh. indicate the number para ano... Baka Hindi tama yung answer, baka nasa ibang number nga lang. So, sabi ni Danica Umbao, D, Constantine D, Allen also, Barbie also, D. Yung kanina, siguro yung A na nabasa ko from Elsa is, ano po, sa number sa previous, six. No? Oh. Yes. Okay, so, so, ang common answer dito ay D. Kindly check, Chitra Bay, if the answer is correct. Okay, yung lone pair ng CISO ay isa lang. Yes, mm-hmm. so, the correct answer is D. Yung dalawang okay. electrons na unpaired. Okay, let's proceed to number 8 now. What is the formula type of a compound with a T-shaped molecular geometry? T-shaped. An- ano ang, ilan ang kanyang bonding pairs at ilan ang kanyang lone pair? Lone pairs. Definitely isa lang yung central atom. So that is the representation of A. X for the attached atom, E for the lone pair. Okay, lone at this point, I'm waiting sa sagot ng ating mga students. Si Constantine, mm-hmm. A, C ang sagot ni Constantine. So, A, X, hey, Iba, baka nagdodrawing pa sila, no? Ang taray. <laughs> Edward, D, D ang sagot ni Edward. Ah, baka yung sa previous pala yan, sorry. So, nag-answer na si Constantine, si Allen, si Aaron, Jared, Linogon, Justin, Almalves, Barbie. Ang answer nila, si Simon, ang answer nila ay letter C. Ayan, napakita na ni Chitra. Okay, number Mamadali. nine. Okay, number nine. What molecular geometry has a formula type of AX3? Again, what molecular geometry has a formula type of AX3? Mm-hmm. Wala siyang lone pair, no? So very basic lang yung kanyang shape. Uh-oh. Number nine, kindly type in number nine, Edward Bagay. Eight, ay, eight pa rin pala yung sinagot ni Edward Bagay. So number nine, kindly type in your answer for number nine. What molecular geometry has a formula type of AX3? The answer is... Um, Reveal ko na ba? Wait lang, Chutra Bay. Okay. Ayan. The answer ni si Sanchea. Yeah? Excited, Chutra Bay. Uh, <laughs> Uh, Sanchea, nag-answer na si Constantine, si Andrea, si Danica, Denise, Aaron, Ken Joshua, Jake Teen, Barbie Noelle, uh, Simon, Alan Mark, Ilona, Christian, Angelica. Ganitong-ganito tayo sa mga sessions natin. Like, marami. Sila-sila din yung mga Oo nga. active. 
Sa, sa number nine, the answer, Chutara Bay, is... Chutara. <laughs> Hi, Danica. Hi, Ken. Letter C. Okay, for number 10. Ayan. Okay, for number 10, Chutara Bay. Okay na? na Nakapresent yes, na ba? Yes, number 10 po. 10 na po tayo. Wala pa? Wala pa po. Ayun. For number 10, what is the correct formula for this molecule? So we have here this illustration. Number 10, may nag-answer na B. O baka sa akin nang pala delay kasi mabilis na nag-answer. Oh, yeah. Constantine, B. Danica Umbao, B. Allen, Barbie, Denise, Andrea, Mandolo. Ang answer nila ay B. Kindly check. Okay. Chitra, babe. Okay. So, pili- tama yung sagot nila. So, SIF4. So, yes, nakaka-proud ang ating mga chutis. Congratulations. First batch pa lang to ng ating question na tutoran. We still have 11 to 20. Uh, later on. Uh, Chitra, nakikita mo ng ating... Yes, ano, nakikita na. Okay. So, we are just inviting everyone no, for the month of February. So, we are not just celebrating Valentine's uh month or valentine sabi mo di mo sasabihin oo oh, oh, nga eh sabi okay. mo nga pero uh, we are uh, also celebrating national arts month with the theme sihinin ng pag-asa so kaya kung mapapansin niyo chutis no sa mga uh, sa face Facebook, especially sa Facebook, ang dami mga nagpo, nagpo-post ng kanilang mga artwork. Kahit dun sa ano natin, sa page natin, ng mga puro teachers, mm-hmm. so ang dami. So siguro, it's time for us to appreciate also those talented people, especially mga Pinoy sila. So we have to be proud sa mga talent. And also, kayo chutis, kung meron din kayong uh, talent sa singing, uh, be proud. I-post nyo rin siya sa Facebook. No? So, sample, sample. Sample. <laughs> Okay, si Chitra Bay, very si unlalaglag. Oo naman. Okay. So, oh, tao, tapusin na natin na. to. <laughs> Move na tayo, no? Okay. So, let's start. Okay na ba tayo, Chitra? Ah? Meron ka pang gustong ipasample ba? Charot. Sa'yo, sa'yo. Gusto mo okay. ba? <laughs> De, balik na tayo dito. Wala tayong oras. Number 11, Chutis. I hope you're ready now. What is the formula type of trigonal pyramidal? So, the structure is already there. So, formula type tayo ulit, no? Ha- given the central atom with the attached atom and the lone pair. A, A, X, 3, B, A, 3, X, 1, E, 1, C, A, X, 3, E, 1, D, A, 1, X, 3, E, 2. Tutor, ah, hindi ko nakikita yung mga okay, comments nila. Okay, so, so maghihintay ako ng answer nila sa comment section. For number 11, you may uh, type in muna the number before you uh, mm-hmm. include your answer. Okay, for number 11... Na ano yata sila sa may Feb Ibig, Feb Ibig Ay, na ito pa sila. sila. <laughs> <laughs> sabi ko na kaya ayoko kung ba ang gitin niya ni. Eh. <laughs> okay, sabi ni Edward Bagay, 11 si po, si Ken Joshua, D. So may nagsabi ng C, may nagsabi ng D. Si Alan C, Danica C, Iverson C, Christian Hulip C. So may nag-answer lang ng D. So let us check if their answer is correct. Si Noelle C, also Constantine Denise Fritz. Okay. okay. So, Next the answer number. is letter C. Yung nagkamali, malamang pumapag-ibig yan. <laughs> <laughs> number 12. What molecular geometry does this molecule exhibit? So, given the structure, is it linear ba? Tetrahedral? Trigonal pyramidal? Or trigonal planar? Nagkamali ka ba nung nagpag-ibig ka? Number 12. <laughs> uh, the answer. <laughs> the answer Ay, is magbasa ka dyan. <laughs> Number 12, wala pa kasi Chutra Abe na nag-answer sa number 12. What molecular geometry does Parang this molecular? Parang naghang sila doon sa Ayan. ating ano. Huwag mo nang manggitin ng PB. Big tumatagal yung type in nila. <laughs> Ayan, Pwede si naman nila lagyan ng heart yung sagot nila, no? <laughs> Dani ka umbaw, 12C. Si Allen D. So nahate sa C or D. Molecular okay, geometry ng, ng NH3. May nagsabi na Justin C, Denise C, Iverson, and Andrea C. So na, uh, may nag-answer ng, ayan, si, puro si pala. Okay. So reveal okay. na natin. Yes. Yan. Trigonal pyramidal. Thank you okay. also, Fritz and Justin, for answering. Also, Aaron. 13. Okay. 
Number 13, which molecule would have this shape? So yung shape na yan, no? So merong uh, central atom tapos may dalawang attachment. Baka lang hindi nila masyadong makita sa ating figure. So letter A, B, F3, B, C, H4, C, P, C, L5, D, B, E, C, L2. Ayan. Number 13, can you indicate the number? Okay, so wala pang nag-answer dito sa for number 13. So alin sa mga molecules na ito ang nagpapakita ng ganyang structure? Si Constantine ang sagot niya, D. Also, Danica, Edward, Allen. Okay, bigyan na natin, no? Ito. O, bigyan pa natin sila ng chance. Ikaw ba? Gusto mo ba? <laughs> or Tony Iverson, Andrea Made. Very Valentine naman tayo sa session. Oh, oh, love, 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 love. Ayan. So, na-reveal ko na yung answer. Okay, the answer. answer. Nag-answer din si Simon, si Frances, si Aaron, si Miguel, Madeo, at Adrian. The answer is letter D. Mm -hmm. BECL2. Okay, number 14. Ito na sa ating mga quantum numbers. The spin quantum number, the M sub S, refers to the A, energy level the electron is in, B, sub level or shape of the orbital the electron is in, or letter C, orientation of orbitals around nucleus, or D, direction of electron spin. Diba? Meron tayong four quantum numbers, the principal, the angular, or the azimuthal, the, the magnetic, and then the spin. Kapag sinabi natin spin quantum number, ano kaya siya? Ayan, daldal -dal mo na naman. <laughs> okay. For uh, spin quantum number, for number 14, ang sabi ni Edward D. Po, and ni Danica Umbao, also ni Aaron Dinogon, D. So, Angelica Gregorio, D. Allen, Barbie, Ilona, um, and Iverson Kilatan. So, reveal the answer na, Chitar Bay, okay, for number the answer is... Okay, the answer is, dog. So, you're all correct. Si Sanchea, Ilona, Arian, Hans Palileo, Francis Elijah. Okay, number 15. Okay, for number 15, we are now... Uh, the magnetic quantum number or the M sub L refers to the same choices lang siya actually. Energy level, the electron is in. B sub level or shape of the orbital, the electron is in. Letter C, is it the orientation of orbitals around nucleus or D, direction of electron spin? It's the magnetic. Okay, the answer, ang answer nila dito sa comment section ay sabi ni Constantine 15C. Okay, let us wait for our other mm -hmm. responses. Constantine, uh, Alan Mark C, Danica Umbao. Okay, sabi ni Danica, it's B. So, naghati sa B at C ang kanilang answer. Si Barbie, uh, si Andrea, si Fritz, ang sagot niya ay C. Si Edward, mm -hmm. ayun bilis, si uh, Miguel C, Ken C, Christian C, Ilona C. Si Edward, bagay po, charap. Ang C, <laughs> <laughs> Nay na separate kasi. Okay, reveal the answer. Reveal the answer. The answer is letter. Okay, the answer is letter D. So ito ay medyo uh, matagal. Uh, medyo matagal ng session. So siguro na dito lang din sila sa sa uh, uh, So feeling ko tama sila. Ay hindi na ano. <laughs> Oo. Oh. Ah, hindi na. Sorry, sorry. So, the answer in number 15 is, they're correct. Anong answer, Tutor Abay? Okay, the answer there is letter C. It's the orientation of orbitals. Sabi mo, ah, uh, <laughs> <na> <laughs> hindi na save. So, so, hindi na save yung na-edit kanina. So, ang sagot sa number 15 ay... Letter C. Go to T. So, tama kayo. Go to T. Tama kayo. Mali yung <laughs> <laughs> ayan, so okay. hindi lang nag-save mm -mm. So ayan, so yes. kinarek naman namin yan kanina Sige po, number uh, 16 Okay, the principal quantum number or the, uh, having the symbol of N refers to the A energy level, the electron is in B sub level or shape of the orbital, the electron is in Letter C, orientation of orbitals around nucleus Or D, direction of electron spin Oh, recognize Prince lang natin na kanina ay tama sila sa kanilang answer oh, 15C oh. So, Congratulations, for number please. 16, the ans ang answer nila sa number 16 ay A, sabi ni Ale, ni Edward, ni Angelica, ni Constantine. 
So ang answer ay ni Barbie Fritz Casas, Francis Elijah Sanchea, Madeo. Okay. Okay, let's the reveal answer, the answer is letter A. Okay. No, now let's proceed with 17. Okay, for number 17, the angular quantum number or the azimuthal quantum number refers to the energy level the electron is in, B sub level or shape of the orbital the electron is in, orientation of orbitals around nucleus or letter D, direction of electron spin. Medyo marami ng questions, so kindly indicate the number as well. Okay, number so seven. the angular quantum number for 17. Sabi ni Constantine, 17B. Uh, Frances, Denise, Miguel, Simon, Iverson, Aaron, Danica, Fritz, Hans, Andrea, uh, Ken, Christian. Ang answer nila ay letter B. Reveal the answer, Chitter B. Okay. The answer is correct. Sub-level or shape of, or of the orbital the electron is in. Okay, congrats to this okay, number 18. Who said that not two electrons can have the same set of four quantum numbers? Is it of Bo, B, Poly, C, Bohr, or D, Hand? Okay. So the answer, binigyan na kagad yung answer. 18. <laughs> answer na kagad. <laughs> Kasi na pressure sa time. Okay, okay medyo maraming kasi yung questions. For 18, uh, sumagot si Rina Bell Shinohara. So, ayan. Answer niya ay D. Si Constantine, sabi niya B. So, uh, nahati so, ang answer. Kasi natin yung... Si Andrea ay B. So, oh, Allen B. Reveal the answer to Terbe. The For answer it, is poly, poly. Coming from poly, poly exclusion principle. Okay. Number 19. 19. An electron in a P sub-level can have a principal quantum number of... A1, B2, C3, D4. Okay. P sub level. Ilan yung ano to? Electron in a P sub level can have. Okay. So, may kinorek pa ni Rinabel. B pala. Opo, ha? Okay. For 19. Binasa ko pa talaga. 19. <laughs> Reveal the answer. Stay tuned lang tayo, mga chutis, kasi meron kami audio-visual presentations oh, okay. very, very soon. Okay, the answer yung number 19, sabi ni Constantine, ay A. So, also ni Ken Joshua and ni Carlos Sagusho. Uy, parang ngayon ko lang na read yung Carlos Sagusho. Okay, si Aaron, Linogon, and Noeli, Ilona, Iverson. Reveal the answer, Chitra Bay. Okay, the answer is letter B. And si Francis and si Miguel nag-answer din si Fritz. For 20, number okay, 20. Okay, last question. Orbital. orbital go sorry. Excited ako. Ikaw na. F is equal to 2 can hold up to ilan ang kayang hawakan na electrons kapag ang principal quantum number ay 2. A, 8 electrons. B, 18 electrons. C, 2 electrons. D, 11 electrons. Okay, for 20, hintay natin ang kanila mga answers. But again, again, stay tuned mga chutis. Mga chutis. Mga chutis <laughs> kasi mamaya meron kami yung very short clip lang. Mm -hmm. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Dito mawal. Okay. Okay, let's... so let's have the answer now. May sagot sila. Super okay, nag-answer na si Allen, si Aaron, si Andrea. Ang answer nila ay letter A. So tingnan natin kung nakuha nila yon. Si Mark Gian and si Andrea. Okay. Arya. Okay, natin. so ang answer is letter A. Very, very good. So, na, uh, yun ang very short review natin for our, uh, quarter two. But again, meron po tayong audio-visual presentation. But before that, uh, I would like to inform everyone that we have invited again our guest, before we present the audio-visual presentation, let us welcome again on this virtual stage our guest tutors for quarter two. For, may I call on this virtual stage from SDO Kidapawan, Tutor Shai, from SDO Aurora, Tutor Ella, and from SDO Kalookan, Tutor Ed. So we invited them para makita din nila yung short video clip na ipepresent natin para sa mga tutees and sa kanila din po, guest tutors at sa mga schools na nag-participate sa atin sa ating itulay session sa quarter 2. Okay? Um, 
let us all watch for the short video clip that we have for our uh, session. Okay. I am Tutor Ann from SDO Las Piñas. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Tutor Abe from SDO Paranaque. Ating pagtulungan kabataan ay turuan natin. Kahit na nasa tahanan, pagkaaral ay tutukan. Oras at kasanayan ay ilaan. Tulong edukalidad, magbago man ng panahon Pagpatuloy ang tinayunin, patatagin ang edukasyon Itulay ang gabay sa pagkatuto Itulay edukasyon ni tatawid sa'yo Itulay paaralan di lalayo sa'yo Itulay sa makabagong panahon Itulay para sa Our unit, our school division office, particularly the curriculum implementation division and uh, uh, follower of this intervention program as we verge into the uh, hybrid flexible learning Itulay has been revolutionary on its part I believe in, in the power of this platform Niniwala kasi kami that the teaching learning process is not teacherless. It will require facilitators of learning. And in the cases of learners who, who lack home facilitators, it lies there to, to reach them, to help them process yung learning na kinakailangan nila in everyday uh, schedule nila sa kanilang distance learning or home-based learning. Sa'yo, ito lang paaralan Lalayo sa'yo Dito tayo sa makabagong panahon Dito tayo para sa kapatang Pilipino Dito tayo ang gabay sa pagkatuto Dito tayo edukasyon itatawid sa'yo Dito tayo paaralan di lalayo sa'yo Itulay sa makabagong panahon Itulay para sa kabataang Pilipino Itulay, itulay sa kabataang Pilipino Itulay, itulay sa kabataang Pilipino Itulay, itulay Okay, muli, I am Tutor Abe from SEO Paranaque Sama-sama natin itulay ang pagkatuto I am Tutor Ann from SEO Las Piñas. Sama-sama natin itulay ang bayanihan para sa mga batang Pilipino. O oh, yan, nice, Tutor Ann. Nice. Yan. So, we invited our guest, yung mga guest tutors natin, pero mamaya sila magme-message. Mm -hmm. Pero ngayon, we just want them to say hi to all the students nationwide. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Hello, Tutor Shai, Tutor Ed, and Tutor Ella. So, Mama Yapo will get back to you uh, as we award you for uh, being our guest tutors for this session. But as you wait po, you may stay at the backstage po muna as we award the certificates for the tutees. Gusto lang po namin makita yung reactions nyo as you watch the video. <laughs> Kaya we invited you muna po sa on stage. Mama Yapo will call you again. Thank you po. Thank you. Okay, for the Chuti Award, let us Ayan. present the certificates sa ating mga Chutis. Go, Chuta Arbe. Okay, so allow me to read the text. Certificate of Recognition. Uh, this certificate is presented to Edward Baga. Siya lagi una po, no? For actively participating in the Itulay Online Tutorial for Senior High School General Chemistry 1 in the second quarter of the school year 2021-2022, conducted by the ICT's Educational Technology Unit, given this 7th day of February 2022 in Deped Central Office, Meralco Avenue, Pasig City, Philippines. Okay, Local Saint Edward. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, Sister Abe. Same certificate. Okay. Same certificate is awarded to Miguel C. Tanyola de Ford from Las Piñas National High School, SDO Las Piñas NCR. Okay, and same certificate uh, is awarded to Casas. Mm -hmm. Same certificate for Fritz Casas, Iverson L. Quilatan, um, Angelica Gregorio. 
Aliana Chacon, Frances Elijah Bacasmas, I, uh, Isa Ebrada, Hans David Palileo, Mark Gian Abejero, okay. Mark so Bejo Amito. Mm -hmm. Go to Trabe. <laughs> okay. Mark James Delbo, Jana May Chamzon, Alfredo Aguirre Jr., Mark Joven Bilaos, Constantine K. Del Rosario, Ken Joshua Haiktin, Hanania Necesito, I and Irene Jane Lubay. Okay. Congratulations. That's the reason why I asked uh, Alan Mark to message me. Mm -hmm. Kasi naalala ko nga pala na si, El, si Alan Mark ay very consistent. Minsan nauna rin pa siyang mag-ano mag-comment. So, okay. ayan. You um, kindly message me via messenger. Uh -huh. So, at this point, we will award the certificate to our guest tutors again. Let us welcome again them on virtual stage. Our guest tutors for second quarter sa General Chemistry 1 from SDO Kidapawan, Tutor Shai. From SDO Aurora, Tutor Ella. And from SDO Kalookan, Tutor Ed. Okay, uh, let us uh, welcome again the, them. So uh, allow me to read the certificate. Certificate of recognition. This certificate is presented to Shaira M. Dano. I was uh, corrected, teacher 2 from SDO Kidapawan, Region 12, for sharing her invaluable teaching expertise as guest tutor in Itulay Online Tutorial for school year 2020 to 2021. Uh, conducted by the ICTS Ed, uh, EdTech Unit, given the 7th day of February 2022. Okay, so we will be giving you the corrected certificate for this. Mm -hmm. Ganon din po. Next certificate, the same certificate is given to uh, Maria Erlinda J. Mata from SDO Aurora Region 3. Also, the same certificate is given to Sir Edelito G. William Moore. Again, the corrected certificate will be given via email. I'll be getting your email po. Thank you po for saying yes to uh, share your expertise para makatulong sa ating mga students. So, uh, uh, let me ask some message to Trabe. Oh, yes. Maybe we can ask simple message from them para sa mga tutors na nakasama natin for this quarter. So, let's start with yes. Tutor Shai, followed by yes. Tutor Ella and Tutor Ed. Okay, so hello everyone. Good afternoon. For all the students all over the Philippines, I hope that you will continue to participate and of course to appreciate the essence of our free online tutorial by our DepEd Itulai and our DepEd EdTech unit which are shared by our volunteer tutors. Although uh, COVID-19 situation hinders all of us from uh, the optimal learning experience, May this uh, situation will never take away the, our interest to study since the knowledge that we acquire today can be used to help us uh, in our future or in the near future. So on behalf of Samuel Cruz National High School, SD Okidapawan, with our school principal, Dr. Christine Charity A. Johnson, thank you. Uh, Deped Itulai for the opportunity to be one of uh, to be part of the one of the sessions of our of the Deped Itulai. Thank you so much and God bless us all. Thank you for Ojiba. Thank you, Chutter Shai again for saying yes. Chutter Ella. Ang ating yes, mga students, so mag-comment din na mag-send ng message sa comment section. Chutter Ella. Yes, po. so good afternoon, everyone. Uh, once again, I would like to thank the DepEd EdTech Unit for this opportunity to be one of the guest tutor in one of the sessions in our free online tutorial. So, sa gitna nga po ng pagharap natin sa pandemya, uh, God really works in our midst. Uh, he allowed to use the advancement of technology to be a platform for students' continuous learning. So, kaya habang po, uh, hindi pa tayo tuluyang nakakawala sa problemang dala ng pandemyang ito, sama-sama pa din po nating itawid ang pagkatuto. So patuloy nating gamitin ang free online tutorial na hatid ng DepEd EdTech Unit. So thank you po. 
Thank you, Tutor Thank Ella. You, itawid Ella. yung sa kanila sa atin itulay. Dahil nga sila, yes, Tutor, itawid. Okay, sa atin ay itulay ang pagkatuto. Yes, Tutor Ed. Okay. Um, magandang hapon po sa inyo lahat. Again, our dear students, maraming salamat sa inyong uh, patuloy na pagsuporta at pagtangkilik sa uh, Deped Itulay. Patuloy kayong sumuporta at i-recommend i- din ninyo yung mga videos ng uh, Deped Itulay no? sa inyong mga kaibigan o kaya mga kapwa sudyante. Dahil hanggang sa matapos kayo sa senior high school at maging pagtungtong ninyo sa college, eh, magagamit niyo talaga itong mga videos na ito. No? So, Maraming salamat din sa Deped Itulay at sa ating mga naggagandahang mga tutors na sina Tutor Ann and Tutor Abay para sa opportunity na ibinigay nila sa akin para ako'y makapagturo sa inyo. So muli po mula sa uh, SDO Kaluokan, sa Tala High School, muli po maraming maraming salamat. Thank you, Tutor Ed. Oh, Sa word na gagandahan. <laughs> Nagkaganda, <laughs> nagkaganda. Uh, thank you, Chatter Ed. Thank malaking you, tulong. Magaling tu- ma- magaling tulong. Madaling, uh, ma- ano yan? Malaking tulong kayo sa amin, sa mga nag-volunteer uh, tutors. Kasi uh, I know, kami, we are blessed na nabigyan kami ng gantong opportunity. But when we asked you to to be a volunteer also, nag-yes po kayo kagad. Although nakakakaba kasi nationwide, pero nakakatuwa na hindi kayo nagdalawang isip. You accepted the challenge to be of help to our learners. So again, sana po ay maibalik po sa inyo ni Lord ang mga blessing na ginagawa nyo for our learners. Again, congratulations po. We will be sending the certificate sa ating, uh, sa, via email. Si Ma'am Charity Johnson nag-message, Tutor Shai. Congratulations, Ma'am Shaira Gauran Magallanes Dano. O, di ba, kompleto? Congratulations, Chemistry Team, Tutor Anne and Tutor Abby. Thank you po, Ma'am Charity, for allowing Tutor Shai to participate sa tutorial ng General Chemistry 1. So, again, so, this is an opportunity. Yes, Tutor Abby? Tutor Anne, nandiyan naman si, sa baba, si Ma'am Charity, no? Meron din siyang Certificate of Recognition. Christine Charity A. Johnson, EDD, Principal, SD Okidapawan Region 12, for showing her support to promote itulay online tutorial for General Chemistry 1 during the second quarter of the school year 2020-2021 conducted by ICT EdTech Unit. Hi, ma'am. Uh, may i-check lang natin 2021-2022 school year. Hello, uh, ma'am Charity. Ayan, nag-message si ma'am. Uh, thank you very much po to God be the glory. Yes po, para po kay Lord po talaga lahat ang ginagawa natin. Also, our, to award the certificate to Ma'am Madeleine Gatchalian, EPS in Science from SDO Cavite City, Region 4A for showing support to promote itulay online tutorial sa kanilang division po. We'll just correct the school year po, 2021-2022. And also sa CIDG chief, nakakatuwa yung nagsalita kanina sa ating video presentation, Regine Rex Itosco. So, sir, sir congratulate, uh, um, congratulations po for utilizing sa division nyo ang itulay. Nakakatuwa po kasi... Uh, maraming platforms na lumalabas pero you are also sending this to you, students na mga, mga taga Cavite, taga Cavite City. So again po, thank you po for supporting Itulay. For our partner school, so nakakatuwa po, uh, dito na rin naman po si na Tutor Ella, si na Tutor Ed, and Tutor Shai. Uh, we will be also giving the certificate to their schools also for allowing them to participate and also kung inalaw sila, I'm sure this is uh, na-utilize sa kanila mga school. So, simulan na natin. Mm-hmm. Uh, allow me to read the text. Certificate of Recognition. This certificate is presented to Las Piñas National High School, Senior High School, SDO Las Piñas, NCR Region for being most supportive partner school during the second quarter itulay online tutorial. So, ito po ay na-utilize sa Las Piñas National High School, Senior High School and also I asked permission sa principal for this to be used. And also, the same certificate is given to Paranaque National High School, SDO Paranaque, NCR Region, for being the most supportive partner school. And also, kay Ma'am Charity Johnson, kay, Ma- kay Tutor Shai, from Saniel Cruz National High School, SDO Kidapawan City, Region 12, again, for uh, supporting Itulay sa inyong school and division. And uh, for Dipakulao National High School from SDO Aurora Region 3, thank you for utilizing Itulay para sa inyong mga students, for sending this via messenger para sa mga students na nangailangan ng inyong assistance. And also from Tala High School, SDO Kaloocan Region, NC, uh, NCR Region, 
for being the most supportive partner school. Thank you for utilizing, for sending uh, the link via messenger para sa inyong mga students para makaabot sa kanila yung mga discussion. Maraming maraming salamat po again. And guest tutors, ayan, uh, take this opportunity na as uh, as you as you say your message. Nasabi niya yung message niyo kanina, so before you leave the the this platform kung may final na sasabihin pa po kayo yes tutor ella ah uh, thank you thank you for the opportunity so again i am tutor ella from sdo aurora <laughs> and tutor ed Shout out po sa principal po namin si Dr. Joel B. Salvador at sa aming uh, science coordinator, Ma'am Chona Santo Domingo at sa lahat ng aking mga students dyan sa uh, Tala High School. So hello sa inyong lahat at again maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat sa uh, pagtanggap sa akin dito sa Deped Itulay. Before mag-thank you ni Tutor Shaira sa kanya mga uh, ad sa kanilang admin also, Tutor Ella take this opportunity for saying thank you then sa yung mga um ah, yes boxes. yes so um i would like to thank uh, our principal ma'am Esperanza G. Velasco for allowing me to be one of your uh, guest tutor in one of your sessions and thank you sa mga uh, estudyante ko grade 12 BO and grade 12 Agu uh, grade 11 Aguilar for um for using watching our uh, online tutorial Ayun. Thank you, Tutor Ella. Thank you, Tutor Ed. Tutor Shai. Yes po. So, uh, thank you to our very supportive principal, Dr. Christine Charity A. Johnson, for allowing me to say yes and go sa ating general chemistry one sa ating deputy tulay. And also, thank you so much, Tutor Anne and Tutor Abi, for the invitation and from the Deped Itulay, thank you so much po. Maraming salamat and amping kanunay. Thank you po. Wow, thank you po. Baka hindi share po itong link din sa uh, for second semester. Um, na we offer also physical science with Tutor Lester and Tutor Mel. We have also empowerment technologies. for uh, We have Tutor Jane and Tutor Janelle. We also have DRRR, Disaster and Readiness and Risk Reduction, Tutor Edson, Tutor Echo, and Tutor Leo. And for General Biology 2, Tutor uh, Easter and Tutor Tina. I hope some of your co-teachers will be able to also share as guest tutor sa mga subjects that you offer sa second quarter. Marami po salamat mga guest tutors natin. Thank you po sa pagpasok ngayong hapon na ito. God bless po. Thank you, ma'am and sir. Thank you po. Thank you po. Okay, for for uh, kindly like and subscribe and share mga kaitulay ang ating DepEd Itulay Facebook page and DepEd Itulay YouTube channel. Ito ay magiging kapakipakinabang sa ating mga students. So for feedback, so ayan, dahil nandito pa ang ating mga tutors, mamaya sama na lang po kayo sa ating muli. So kung na kung na -re remember niyo nagmumuli kami ni Tutor Abey. So ayan, for feedback matters, your feedback matters to us. We openly welcome your feedback, comments. Yung mga students na nandito ngayon, um you may please you um access this link at mag-iwan kayo ng feedback form. Kung ano man po yung message niyo, uh, comment, suggestion, wag lang complaints. <laughs> complaints na kalagay diyan. <laughs> Wala naman okay. siguro. Next slide po. Okay. Next, up next na po is we have media uh, information literacy, uh, summative assessment din nila ngayon and recognition. Uh, uh, we have tutor Kath and tutor Zai. And for general biology one, tutor Wendy and tutor Eric. Uh, next slide please. Sige, bago tayo na pinakuling magmumuli. Uh, yeah, sige, direct, sige. pa unti-unti na lang kami ng out po, direct. So we have, let's start na po ng muli. So state your name from what division and then uh, yun. Um, sa amin po kasi sa amin namin, sama-sama natin ito like. Kayo po, whatever you want to say. Muli, yes, tutor. Ella, gusto mo? Simula ka? Go. <laughs> okay, yes po. So muli, I am tutor Ella from SDO Aurora. Sama-sama natin itawid ang pagkatuto. Wow, so tutor Ed. 
muli po, uh, ako po si Tutor Ed Villamor mula sa Tala High School, SDO Kalookan. Sama-sama po tayo sa pagkatuto. Ang <laughs> galing! Okay. Muli, Cheers, I am man. Shira M. Dano from SDO Kidapawan. Muli, sama-sama nating may tawid ang kaalaman. Wow. Okay. On the so, spot sila, no? Ang galing talaga ng mga tutors. <laughs> Sorry lang, on the spot namin kayo. <laughs> Teka lang, nag-message si na Miguel Calvo. Uh, thank you po, Tutor Shai, Tutor Ed, Tutor Ella, syempre Tutor Ann, and Tutor Abe. So this is our, yung last session. So Tutor Abe, ito yung last time na sasabihin natin itong muli natin. So try Uh-oh. natin. Uh, so before po. that, uh, shout out muna and thankful ako sa aking mga ano, boss, sa aking uh, principal, Sir Jerry A. Lumaban, our vice uh, principal for senior high school, Sir Rodel Vallejos, and of course, the head, uh, uh, department head ng science. So we have Ma'am Rowena Reyes for allowing me to do this uh, despite sa mga busy and ang daming ginagawa. So thank you, Ma'am and Sir, for allowing me to do this. Muli, I am Tutor Abe from SDO Paranaque. Sama-sama nating itulay ang pagkatuto. Bago akong magmuli, I would like to thank Dr. Joel Tito Recampo, SESA 6, our SDS. Dr. Uh, Sir Juan C. Obierna, our assistant a- 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 SDS, our ASDS. And definitely to my principal who allowed me to do this online tutorial, uh, Mr. Ignacio Elson Jr., maraming maraming pong salamat. And uh, muli, I am Tutor Ann from Las Piñas National High School, Senior High School, SDO Las Piñas. Sama-sama, nating mag, sama-sama tayong magbayanihan para sa mga batang Pilipino. Marami pong salamat. God bless. Thank you, students. STEM students, thank you. Ang husay naman. Natapos mo ang iyong tutorial session kasama ang iyong mahusay na itulay tutor. May bago ka bang natutuhan? I-share na yan gamit ang hashtag itulay level up. Huwag aalis ha dahil may susunod pang programa na pwede mo panoorin at salihan. Dahil naghihintay na ang iyong mga tutors. Happy learning dito sa itulay!